Hello everyone, this is Sharmin Khan from Milky Way Art Design. So today I'm going to work on this hexagonal tile and it's going to be a little piece. I just wanted to do some um, fun pouring. So um, today I am going to use a lot of the prism pour and lately I'm using those and I'm loving the results that I'm getting. You can see that the um, colors that I'm using, I poured them on these little containers, but I did not mix anything with them. There's no pouring medium in mixed into this. The only reason I poured them on the uh, container to make sure that I am putting just the right amount of paint if I scoop it out rather than squeezing the bottle. It's just being cautious since it's the first time or like um, I should say, um, I'm new to using the prism pour. So let's start with the base coat. This is my Gideon Essential interior eggshell. And I'm going to spread out a tiny bit to make sure that um, things go faster. Like I said, it's just a quick pour. The first three colors were prism pour and now I am ad adding the candy apple from Art's Mind. As you can see, as I'm layering the paints, it's getting messy. It's like splattering everywhere. Um, honestly, it really doesn't matter because once you blow it, everything is going to get covered up. So that's why I'm not very concerned about uh, making or getting rid of those uh, sprinkles here and there. Now I am adding the black cell activators and this is the paint where I have my Australian float troll mixed into it and I'm going to blow the puddles. Basically, I'm going to spread the black cell activator onto the uh, paint as I blow diagonally and that black paint is going to create all the cells.
the first color that i'm using for the first flower is the knockout from arts mind and on top of that i'm using the ganache from tlp oh this is such a pretty color for the second flower i am using vermilion from windsor newton that's my first layer of the uh, it's kind of like orangish color bright orange color and on top of that i'm using the groovy from tlp and that groovy has a little bit of quintochrome uh, blue violet from master's touch professional series mixed into it and then i add 24k gold from deco art americana on bo both of them and at the end i will add some cell activator Now it's time to blow.
at this point i'm looking at the composition and i see that there's this little white spot right beneath the red flower and i am trying to create some interest on those white spots so the whole entire um, surface looks complete I'm actually really happy with the composition. Don't you think so? Um, the, uh, I, at the beginning, I was thinking I wanted to add more flowers, and then I added the two, and I feel like those two are just perfect. I don't need anything extra. I hope you liked this video uh, or this um, tile composition, and now I'm thinking I'm going to do another one. Now this is my final product which is already dried. So this is my second tile and I am going to use the same color scheme but I am going to alternate between the blue greenish and the uh, red orangish. Those of you who are still watching this video, you will realize that this video was um, done intended for the beginners um, who are trying to do this uh, technique um, often in my uh, channel i put some of the compositions which are more complex and then again here and there i try to add some of the beginners um, work as well it kind of balances out or addresses every uh, level of the viewers so i hope you are enjoying the video This time I am going to layer the flower colors first and when I was doing this in my back of my mind I was thinking about poinsettias.
okay so accidentally the phone dropped onto my surface so you can see that's why my phone dropped so let's see if i can recover that Stay here, Karan. I can't even look at okay ladies and gentlemen as you can see i dropped my cell phone on my uh paint and that's the result so i have to fix it somehow i could scrape the whole thing and restart again but this is my personal challenge can i fix it and make it work after even when my when i dropped my phone on the paint
so this is how pretty it is up close and this is my dried result